Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, you got here just in time. That's right, just in, it's Friday. And we're just in time for another episode of Friday's Finds. I got a package. I'm not sure what's in it. I've talked to a lot of people over the last couple weeks. They said they're gonna send us stuff for Friday's Finds. This is a, a child proof package almost. Adult proof. It's dude proof. Ah, you think I know what this is? From Anarchy. Creative, or well, created for security. Anarchy. Can you read that? Oh, there we go right there. Anarchy. And Anarchy. Anarchy. So Yappy. This is so cool. Yappy is always worried about her babies, you know. Anytime we're traveling in the RV, she is so desperately afraid to leave them by themselves in the coach. She just won't do it. So we're, we're always taking them with us no matter where we go. And that's fine, that's cool, but it limits activities. And so I've been thinking, you know what we need? We need a webcam. We need a puppy cam in the RV. And when Anarchy reached out to me and said, would I be interested in trying out and demoing and putting this on Friday's Fives, I said, oh yes sir, I am most interested. Because this is, this is cool. It's a little webcam. So we have the camera. We have mounting hardware. So you get a little disc. You can mount that to the wall or the ceiling. The USB power. It comes with a little anchor set. And we have power supply and that that's all that's in the box with the exception of the user manual and I, I have a couple of these mounted similar cameras mounted I have some webcams up here so we have webcams covering the whole house. That's, this is gonna go in the motor home. Uh, once I work with it and figure out, there's two way communication through it as well. Meaning you can talk to them and they'll talk back. So let me figure out how this all works and we'll go get Trudy Thunder. So let me read some instructions. One thing I've learned is 2.4 only. So if you've got a combined Wi-Fi signal and most of your, your high speed, like we have AT&T fiber here, you've got to split that 2.4 signal out. Now on Starlink, I don't know if I have the option to split out the 2.4, I'll have to delve into that. So originally was trying to connect this to Starlink so we can just take that with us to the RV and we're connected. I don't know if I can split that out. 
and I don't know so I'll have to explore our other mobile Wi-Fi options to see if I have the ability to separate that out for this particular camera uh, so let me work on this a little more I'll be back all right Yappy's gonna be real happy so I was able to I found that the jetpack that we use actually has 2.5 or 2.4 and the 5 gigahertz separated so I was able to connect the camera to the jetpack so we can now operations are done and we are booting up there we go So this this is you know it's a wire Wi-Fi wireless camera that you know you can control and you can talk. So you can you can look around the room, you can mount it in any position, you can communicate through the camera with the speaker, and also take a picture. And it will hold an S, a, 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 a small card. It'll hold one of those little SD cards like I put in my camera. And it will continually record and then start overriding when the card gets full. Or you can connect it to a cloud account and upload everything to the cloud. And, and the, it's pretty simple as long as you know your Wi-Fi password. You gotta make sure you're on 2.4 and you know the password. Otherwise, you will not have success. Now I just need to put it in the RV and see how it works there. But if it works here with the jet pack, then it's, it's gonna work in the RV. So, but we're still gonna go to the RV and let you see it in motion in the RV. Because this is, after all, the Dude RV Friday's Fine Show. Stay tuned. More to come. We are talking about the new RV wireless camera system that we're putting in place. Courtesy of Aniki on Amazon. Now, you can find this, tech, this camera on Amazon. The link will be in the description below and in the card above. I've come over to the coach, so I gotta get this all set up to make Yappy happy. And I've been working first. We're mounted inverted. You'll notice it's it's tracking. This has got a really cool human tracking feature. So if you mount this in your house and someone comes in, it'll find you. How you doing? Come over here. Anyway, there are a lot of options on the app. So there's a night mode, anti-flicker. You can record playback. You snap a picture. If you want to see it in a better angle, you can flip the screen. For our purposes, we have the dog kennel set up. I'm gonna go in and turn off the human tracker. back over here now you can zoom in you can drag the screen around you can control the up and down the vertical now I did have to do a 180 degree flip so it's not a mirror image when I when I hung it up like that I had to do another flip so that it was the correct orientation 
it'll only go down so far so it'll this will be the the horizon so you can rotate it here and what i'm trying to say is if you had that sitting on a the counter i had it sitting on the counter i couldn't get it down far enough to see the dog kennel but hanging up it actually gives me a better i can see the whole rv pretty much with the exception of the bedroom from that one location i'm connected through the verizon hotspot the jetpack so yappy can now control the puppy cam it's the puppy cam all that remains to be seen now is can we go somewhere else and still control and watch so that's what i'm gonna do we're gonna go get in a pickup and drive to the other side of the storage facility and see if we can see what see what we can see so i'm in the pickup looking out the window at the coach which is right there and here we're looking in the camera i should have brought one of the dogs with me <laughs> so we could verify I don't have any any way to show you real time it's working other than showing you the, the image on the phone but it is working and it's working really well I'm really excited this this is gonna make my lovely bride most happy and we got to keep yappy happy because if yappy's not happy ain't nobody happy all right, back into the coach. Back in the coach. All right, okay. We've determined that the camera functions remotely. Thanks to the Verizon wireless card, I can control it from however far away I want to be. I can. We can still see the dog kennels. We can actually look down at the driver's seat. But of course, the jetpack has to be on in order for that to work now, maybe at some point i'll explore also connecting it to i don't think i can have two different uh, wi-fi connections so i think i only connect to one wi-fi source if i can connect to two wi-fi sources i'm going to explore connecting it to the onboard modem so we're now set up to be able to watch the puppies when we're not here and we're we're out camping we're on the road traveling we we're not captive to crossing our fingers and hoping our puppies are okay we can look at them in the camera and watch now all right that brings us to the end of this friday's finds video i'm really impressed with the little anarchy wireless cam and i know you will be too the link is in the card above and in the description below if this is your first visit to Dude RV, thank you. I sure appreciate you stopping by. For those of you who have been following along, thank you. I am most honored. That's why I do what I do. Thank you for that opportunity. And for my patrons, you rock. All right, y'all come back now, you hear?